Welcome to Hillsborough County's NPDES training video. We are going to be discussing storm drains, specifically what flows into them. Under federal and state regulation, the county is required to minimize the discharge of water pollutants, such as trash, nutrients, sediment, and bacteria through stormwater drains into other bodies of water. Yes, all of the scenarios that you see are preventable. Your responsibilities in protecting our water resources are to report, prevent, and respond to any instances of pollution. Any discharge into a stormwater drain that isn't entirely stormwater is considered an illicit discharge. They can come in different forms. What's most important is that you report anything suspicious that you may see, such as pipes that stick out or don't appear to belong, discolored, murky, or foamy water, and illegal dumping. If possible, try to get a picture of the discharge from a safe distance and send an email to reportpollution at hillsboroughcounty.org. Be sure to include your photos, the location of the incident, as well as any other details to help identify the problem. Other options are to contact your supervisor or call environmental services. Prevention is our next key to success. A messy shop can lead to trouble. You should take steps to prevent an incident. You should be able to locate and properly use the spill response kit. To prevent spills, any chemicals should be properly stored in secondary containment and properly labeled. Fuel also needs to be stored in its own proper secondary containment. In addition, be sure to check all vehicles and equipment for leaks. Wash vehicles away from storm drains and use a truck pad whenever possible to prevent contamination. Another important part of prevention is on-site erosion control. Erosion leads to turbid water pollution. In the United States, waters receive up to 400 million tons of sediment a year. Prevention starts within the Construction General Permit, which includes a stormwater pollution prevention plan and erosion control best management practices. A silt fence, when properly installed, protects waterways from construction sediment. However, if not installed properly and without maintenance, they can be washed out and leak sediment. This is how a properly installed silt fence should look. Storm drains must also be protected, not with hay bales and definitely not left exposed. Gutter guards and grate guards keep contaminants out of storm drains and should be installed on every drain on site. A messy site is an eyesore and a source of pollution. A clean site equipped with proper guards and a street free of dirt and debris is much easier to maintain. These are necessary to prevent pollution. Turbidity barriers allow water to flow while holding back sediment. However, if the barrier is blocking flow, water can spill over or rip it out. An effective barrier is installed parallel to the water flow and surrounds the work area. Our last step is to respond to spills. Be sure to contain spills immediately. Locate your spill kit, 
and clean up the spill. Never just wash a spill away. So remember, take the time to do every job properly. It's up to you to protect Florida's water resources.